welcome back to today's video. So today we're actually going to a new venue. So we have done an arena hire at, if you know and you live in Essex, there is a brand new equestrian centre called Radley Green. So we have hired the indoor arena, which I'm super excited about because as you may know, we always go to our trusty little local Showbrook farm for any arena hires and lessons. And now we've got a brand new venue, which is literally like 10 minutes away from us. So we're very excited to go try it out. So now I'm just gonna head to the tack room, get me and mum's tack because we're taking Nebo and Danny to do a little bit of flat work with them. So come along with us. So I'm now in my tack room and I'm just about to grab Nebo and Danny's tack. So this is Nebo's saddle right here. Um, I just need to change the girth over because this is the girth that I tried on Amaretto. But his saddle is thankfully all clean as I put it on Amaretto the other day and I did wipe it over. So that's clean. Not too sure about mum's. But Nebo's saddle is all clean. Mum wants her dressage saddle and then she wants her drop nose band bridle. So that's her tackle there. She may need to give that a little wipe over because it is pretty dirty. Um, and then I'm just going to ride Nebo in his normal bridle. Which to be honest does need a little wipe down. Um, he's just got his sparkly green lovely crystal diamond brow band. And then, yeah. I will take my Martin gal. Probably won't need it just because I'm doing flat work. But Nebo may need it. So I'm going to take it with me anyway. And then we just need Nebo's dirt, which I have here. And then I've got my riding boots, which are very dirty. Let me off. They, they look good. Um, and then we have, mum wants her nicer hat, as she may say. <laughs> so I'm just going to ride in my trusty kep that I always have. Um, so let's put that up there. And then mum would like to ride Danny in. So I tried this on Amaretto and it is slightly a little bit big, but it does the trick. But we have got these titanium mask which mum wants to try and danny because danny can get a little bit spooky and a little bit lucky especially at new venues so mum's going to take this along it should fit him because it is a large so yeah see if that makes a difference in him so mum is gonna ride in that i just need to find mum's hat um which i'm sure is down here all kept nicely in a hat bag like i should really yep there's mum's hat in there so she's gonna take that i did actually was meant to bring the bar around but i forgot so that's not good but um so i'm not too sure how i'm gonna carry it all and then also i forgot to tell you it's a little bit dirty but i bought an air jacket so i bought the halite air jacket which goes over the show jacket which just looks so nice and smart and it also keeps you nice and safe so mum has this type of air jacket but I have gone for the more sleek looking one. But this is perfect for cross country to be able to put body protector on because underneath it is just a little bit big for me where this is more fitted. Um, so I'm gonna take them because, I don't know. I feel like I need to start riding in it, but I don't know if I'm gonna ride in it. But I only really ride in it for jumping. We just put it on top just in case. So it just started hammering down. I've just got the tap in the wheel right now and the trailer's out, but it started raining and Nebo is in the field. I've got to go get Nebo. His head collar. Come Nebs. Hello, Bubba boy. Should we go in? hammering it down. What on earth? Why? Why, 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 why? We are soaked. <laughs> Not good. You've got to wash legs and get on the trailer. 
can go to the arena higher in the rain. So the rain has finally stopped and we're just quickly getting some boots on before we get there. Mum's just popping Danny's boots on. Danny, it's a little bit dirty, he's still got mud on his face. I am, I'm trying. <laughs> she, she's trying, he was very, very, very dirty. <laughs> Knee boys all ready. Ready Nibs? Hair's a bit wet, got caught in it a little bit. Ready to go. They're all loaded up. We couldn't really film it. It was a bit chaotic in the rain. <laughs> it, was, it was like a proper, <laughs> we had a proper proper down downpour. Down. It just all come down at once. But they're all and then on we the had trailer. two horses screaming to come in, so we had to yeah. run around and get them in between. One's had its legs, so it's in, and it's calling at the others. So we were like, let's just bring them in quickly because we don't want to leave that one upset. So we've brought that one in. We've got lots of lots of tack in the back. I feel very stressed. Yeah, the tack's dirty. Like, the ponies are dirty. Uh, the wind, winter is winter just dirty. Winter is just gross, isn't it? Yeah. So it doesn't matter how much, you know, you could spend, if you had all day, you could clean your horses, but obviously us people, no, haven't got the time. But I did get the mud off his face, by the way, because yeah. I know that's To be honest, Nebo hasn't got one bit of mud on him, but he is clean. Just to rub it in your face a little bit. Yeah, but, I mean, but Nebo keeps himself immaculate. Well, yeah, Danny's he doesn't real. even roll. Where Danny gets it all up his neck, his face, everywhere. Yeah, can anyone relate a question? Look at the hands. Got three nails left painted from Christmas. I don't even bother. Middle one's missing and half of one on there. I think it's time to take them off now. Christmas is over. Just go back to me grabbing. We're excited. New venue. Bradley Green. Yeah. We're try it out. We didn't actually go to the open day because I think it was treacherous rain it's on the open cold. day. And it's quite posh. I can't tell you how grubby we look. Yeah. Oh well. It's the reality, isn't it? I'm um, just going to have to strip all the like waterproofs off and just ride and be cold because I'm clean underneath. Yeah, so. And I'll soon warm up because I'm not riding fit. Well, I don't think. I have not. I've had a few. Well, about a week off from riding, haven't I? That yeah. I've not even ridden because the weather. It's just been a weather. Me not really feeling it with the weather. And we'll the have to set the tripod yeah, up in there all... and then I can see how bad I've got. Yeah, we're, we've. I think we're going to bring the tripod in there anyway. It's not a big one, so I'm hoping that they have like a side that we can put it on. So this is the lovely indoor that we have got for the hour, which is lovely. We're just going to try and put you up here so you can have a little look. <laughs>
arena a lovely mirror a lovely mirror to look at yourself oh i wish i had this arena at home <laughs> be a dream wouldn't it nibs you may have to pop a few jumps what do we think <laughs> come on bubba i've got the air jacket tucked in i thought i'll bring it Need to get used to wearing it. And I don't feel like I've got anything on, to be honest. It just feels like a little body warmer. Boy, Dan. A meter course, little nibble, short little legs. Come on. Next mission is to get mum to jump, Danny. Next time, yeah. <laughs> look at him. He's only got small little legs. That's what he jumps. I put it on the wall. 
Je bam. Go back to the trailer. <laughs> so the horses are all loaded up, and we had a hot chocolate and mum had a coffee, and then a tuna sandwich from the lovely cat. So lovely. And yeah, it's just really nice. We had a quick look at the cross country course, which I actually forgot to vlog, but maybe we'll keep it a little surprise for when we oh, go on and to do it. But it's absolutely amazing. And then they've got the outdoor. All did a dressage arena also. They feel a very, track. very, very, very lucky to have yeah. this in our area. Like, and literally 10 minutes from the farm. Yeah, still got my safety jacket on. Mum's still got her safety jacket on. Don't know why, maybe she doesn't trust her own driving. But, oh god, <laughs> we've still got our big, thick coats on. We've had a lovely time. But we've, honestly, it's been amazing. I've had the best time. Yeah, and Fee got to jump on bow, which was nice. Yeah. She exercises both ponies. And it's it's handy even to whip up here because we're having no Danny a pony. Yeah. Having <laughs> no arena at home, just to be able to come up here, like take the two horses. We can take an extra girth, and you can literally just Mum can school Danny, which she loves. I can school Nebo and then I can jump Nebo and she can always, I can always jump on Danny if I want to jump him. So yeah, it's handy and it's and it's quite nice because the indoor is just that tad little bit longer and wide off so it's perfect for Danny to do some jumping in because I have trouble jumping Danny in arenas uh, they're indoor do, they're doing, because uh, they're, doing, they're just so narrow. They're doing clinics there so they've got a bigger dress out arena, they've got a big show jumping and the cross country is like incredible Amazing. so i'm hoping they get some really good trainers there and we can have this some clinics well not me <laughs> uh, but yeah so we're back to the farm we've just unloaded the boys and i've just gave him a little brush just because he was a bit sweaty but he did have his fan sex on so i've just whipped that back on him he's a little bit scared of the light but he get used to it um and now he's just in his stable having some hay while well, he dries off but he is pretty dry already what your nibbles too much the light oh yeah it's great is it very and then danny is having some solarium time so danny's under the solarium because He's a little bit sweatier, aren't you, Bubba? So he's having a little sunbed. Hey? Eh? Then he's gonna go in his stable because it is about half three now. And we've got to get the others mucked out. And then, well, we've got to get Danny, Jack, Massimo, Malegra, and Honey mucked out. And then everyone just needs to be brought in. So I'm just going to go around and muck them out quickly. And hopefully they're not too dirty because they normally are. And if they are, I will then cry. So I'm just in the pony barn and just turn the lights on. This is what we're dealing with. Not too bad, but it's very, pretty dirty. But let's get them mucked out. <laughs> it's been a few hours now and it's completely dark outside. As you can see, but I've got the trusty LED light. So it makes my lighting still look amazing. I've just got the little babies in and I've plaited Malegro's hair just because it's just getting thick mud in it. Not that the plaits even really help, but his hair has got so long. I've just sort of just done a quick little running braid in it. Um to try and help it. He's just in 
having some grass. Grass hay? <laughs> strong me. So yeah, he's just in having some hay. Honey is in. I'm not even gonna attempt to brush her hair. She just doesn't really enjoy it. <laughs> Do you? It's just a constant battle chasing you around the stable with a hairbrush. But no, yeah. You want to sell it to the camera? They're just having their hay. They're nice. Yeah. <laughs> the horses are all done. Ponies are in. Nebo's in. Amaretto's in. Jack's in. The liveries are in. And Massimo, Danny, and the rest. They're all in. Everyone is all done. I'm just off to find mum because I do not know where she is, but she wants to clean in tack. But it's pitch black. I can't see. I just got find her. Mum is cleaning tack <laughs> and yeah so all the horses are bed, mum's cleaning tack, just got the saddles left haven't you? We, yeah and your boots. I wore them out to catch the horses in the field. I do tell her not to. But Oops. Never mind we can get them up like this. Yeah. Um, so yeah so thank you so much for watching today's video, I hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and follow me on Instagram which is Fifi's underscore Welsh underscore ponies. Bye! Bye!